mostly, mostly back. Every now and then, I'll say something and it cuts out slightly, which is weird, but that's fine. Future Laura can fix those problems. She is the problem fixer, but also the person who makes, you know, me the butt of every single joke. So, let's play some DC. Today, there is new content that has come out. Oh yeah, also welcome lovely people. <laughs> I got excited because I can record again, you know? It's fun, I like recording. She also neglected to say that she's playing on the Xbox with the exception of the raid, which we play on the PlayStation US server. I like playing my game and chatting away. So that's what we're gonna do. But there is new content. We're gonna speak with Katana. Katana is over here. Now I will say, I did a stupid thing, and because I wasn't recording until my voice came back, I already read the little thing that comes up on the screen, so hopefully that's in the welcome page. Maybe it's in the welcome page, I don't know. Is it in the welcome page? It's not in the welcome page. Never mind. Ignore the welcome page! <laughs> Even though I messed up, and we can't have the little thing flashy on the screen that says to come and speak to Katana, you come and speak to Katana over I here. I believe you will find these items to be of great interest. And then she will give you an awesome mission to complete, and you'll be like, yes! Sounds great, let's do that. And you'll go over here to the on-duty menu and you'll scroll down over here where it says Outsider Ops. Woo! And we're gonna start with the Corrupted Zamoron Duo. Let's do it. Yay! You may but call me I did come one. in and obviously see I that thing flash up on my screen. And I am here to help. We have little time. Zamoron is in danger, as is all life. We must cleanse Zamoron and get to the power battery Wait. now. I'm playing on my Xbox. Just a little bit late, don't you think? In case anyone is wondering. The Black has returned to the living universe. Admiral and Canada. Is from it's like Captain America, but the not. The indigo light of compassion. It's the Canadian and version. Cleanse this corruption. Okay, let's go. Let's burn all of the bad dudes. I'll burn them. I don't know what you are. You probably don't burn, but you know, we'll kick their butt. And then we will deal with these things. Whee! Take down the Black Lanterns. That's what I meant to say. You know, not burn burn the bad dudes. That sounds like I'm a child. Which I mean, isn't that far from the truth. <laughs> oh, I can't tell you how nice it is to have my voice back. It was really annoying not sounding right. I mean, I still kind of don't sound quite right. But I sound right enough that it's going to be fine. You know? The heat is on. Oh no, that's in my head now. My voice is back. Do, 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 do. I, I love how we're just in the middle of battle here, and you're like, I'm just gonna float cross legged. That's the wrong ability. I'm just gonna float. Float. I can speak English. Oh my goodness, my voice came back, and I regret everything. We're just gonna float in the air cross legged and be tranquil while, you know, you kick the Black Lantern's butt. The Thank you for cleansing the corruption. I shall attack the enemies and burn their faces. <laughs> Ooh, he seems cranky. He also doesn't have a mouth, so how is he speaking? Whee! And such. Yay! Oh, it's in my head now. No, bad, no! <laughs> No more supply officer for you. No. Woo! And we got. Oh, we got. Okay, okay. This is this is handy. I will Style. Cleanse Thank the you. I will cleanse the corruption. How is she so chill when we're burning people? Lanterns. How how is she so chill? I don't think she realizes the direness of the situation. I like how the little ghosty things go floating around. I wish we could get that as something in our base. Like you could place a bunch of these crystals throughout, right? With the, uh, I was gonna say tendrils. It's not exactly tendrils, is it? The corruption, the corruption. It is, is it called corruption tendrils? I don't know, the black thing. That, with that like around some of the Zamoron crystals that you can place them throughout your base and the black little shadow thing will like float between them. I think I expect too much from bases. I, frankly, I just wish this entire level was a base. It's so cool. The All the purple crystals and the hallways and the rooms. I love it. It'd be sad if you couldn't put furniture inside of the like the hallways though. Because that's basically the majority of the base is like hallways. Down you go. It's nice to play something. I know it's not actually 
playing new content, but it's nice to see something interesting going on. But I will say, I will say, I predicted this. Like, uh, we should get to the end of this, like when we're actually up to going to the vendor is when I was gonna start mentioning. But honestly, I said the next thing we're probably gonna see, or the next thing that I expect them to do is to start selling stat points. If I see them selling stat I points, the corruption. I guess what they've done. I mean, it's dressed up as something nice and fun to play, and I will say I am enjoying playing it, even though it's another way to get us to run old content. I am enjoying it, but it could be because it is the Zamoron crystals, and I think they're so pretty, and I love the way it looks when I'm running through here. Maybe that's a contributing factor. But is this not just buying stat points dressed up in a pretty coat? I'm, this is what I thought they were going to do. I thought they were going to start having stat points as something people could purchase. And when they start doing that, they are making it so that it's not the gameplay that gives us the stat points, which means free-to-play people are at a massive disadvantage here. They can get this, don't get me wrong, they can get this through I gameplay. The corruption. But there is an option not to. People can just pay and do it. It's like people who have money in the game can just put their money the in and they get the advantage. People who don't yeah. have to put in a lot of time to try and compensate. And stat points was really the last thing that you had to play through game to actually be able to get and there was no other option. Well now there's another option! I mean they haven't done exactly what I was expecting which I thought they were going to bring out like bundles or something whereby you can purchase the bundle and it will give you unlocked um, feats for older content, specific ones that already exist. Um, so I, I wasn't quite accurate, but I did think they were going to start um, making it so you could pay for stat points, and they have. So I'm glad that it's not exactly what I was thinking. Yes, we must cleanse the power battery. <laughs> the corruption has been halted. Yay! Completely removed into oh. the source of the black has been destroyed. Oh, we're gonna have to kick their butts. The source of the black. Yay! Thank you, Admiral Canada. All right, I'll just make sure this character is... Nope, we haven't. Let's go grab our briefings. But yeah, I really, really expected them to start having bundles that we can purchase that allows us to get Open stat points from older content. the blackest night prophecy and created the Indigo tribe to fight the impending darkness to protect the emotional spectrum and all life. Today, the barrier between the living and the unliving has been weakened. Unliving? The spectrum is under a threat greater than ever. The black has come to challenge the light once again. Natramo. No, oh, I have been here I before. Will not let this come to pass. I have too many characters to remember what I have and haven't played, but it looks like I have been here before and I just missed a, um, a briefing for some reason. There's one that's in a hallway that I can't remember the exact location. Been a while since I was in this content, so bear with me. I will find it. Also, is there a difference between the unliving and the dead? I went back the wrong way. <laughs> Shh, you don't have to point it out. I know, I know. Yeah, so I'm very glad to see that what I predicted is not exactly what occurred. I'm not coughing every time I speak. I'm very glad to see that the content that we have is not what I expected exactly, which was going to be um, older content, uh, older feats now available to unlock through money. Um, so I'm glad that it's not quite that, but I'm a little sad that it's kind of going in the direction that I thought, which is that we are now going to be able to pay our way through stat points. I mean, if this is something they're going to consistently do, it will get us to play older content, which is good. Love playing some of the older content, but it's just, as I said, it is just, there it is, that's the one I was looking for. It's just by stat points dressed up in a pretty coat. I, I don't exactly know how to feel about this. Let's, let's queue up for the alert. I will say maybe I've made a mistake running this through with you guys on Xbox, but um, just because the likelihood of me getting in is a lot smaller than if I were playing on, for example, PSUS. But um, I was on here because I plan to record some other videos today and those videos are on Xbox, so I need to be on here anyway. Which did not even end up happening because after her failed attempt at trying to get into the raid on the Xbox, which she waited for quite some time, she swapped over to the PSUS server in order to play through the raid, which was of course successful because there are so many other players there. And then after the raid was completed, we got into a lovely conversation with Johnny Blaze. Hello, Johnny. Before we had to rush off, and now we are up to editing, which means no other content has been recorded. 
every time I try to swap over my capture card to a new console, my computer goes, oh no, we can't recognize that. And I have to turn everything off, turn everything back on and do it all again. So yeah, we're not gonna do that. We're just gonna try to stick to one console per recording session at a time, which means that I am on the Xbox for this because the next base tours that I need to do are on the Xbox. And provided I can actually get into the load-ins today so that we can do this content, the next thing I'm going to do is obviously base tours because I have people waiting and also I want to look at them because people are so clever and creative and I really want to see them. So, let's hope we get into the alert. While we are waiting on the alert, let's just have a look at the inventory at Katana so you guys can understand what's happening alert, exactly. But here we are. Basically, every time you run through the content of this new event, you are given this particular currency as a reward, which I will show you because I have run through it um, already on this character, obviously, since the, I wasn't able to access that thing that comes up on my screen saying, hey, Katana is telling you to go do these missions and stuff like that. So let's go over here to currency. It is called Outsider Ops 2024 coin. I suspect, but cannot confirm, that all of these currencies that come out where they name them 2024 is done intentionally, letting us know that it's only going to be available for this particular year's event. And next year's event, it's not going to be there, which is a little frustrating because I know I personally do some running of content, like uh, Halloween, for example, run through the Halloween content, grab what I want, save the rest of my currency for the next year if there's nothing that I want at the moment. So that's a little sad. And also people who are running through through this content to try to get the currency because they're aiming Inform for example like. one of these the caches which like this one is a hundred one of one out of one remain this has no currency oh you have to have purchased the skill cash before you can purchase the quarks cash interesting choice um but yeah fair enough i think the point of this is to give people skill points so i understand but anyone who is running through the content to try to get enough to be able to purchase this right and then for whatever reason something comes up in their life they're not able to come here and purchase it they're going to have this currency sitting in their inventory there's <laughs> other things that they can purchase though I don't know whether Katana will still be available. I'm assuming they'll just let Katana still be there and people will be able to spend their currency even after the event because that's what they've done with, for example, Catwoman with the Batman and Wonder Woman event. You were able to keep spending your currency even though the event was over. You could just only spend it on particular things that were no longer part of the event. So I'm assuming they will do something similar here, but that's not the point. That means if it is, as I suspect, that the 2024 coin is only available for this year, as soon as we hit next year, anyone who has played through the content to try to save for this will have to play through it again. It's basically restricting people to make sure they play every single day to get enough content. Uh, currency. And not only that, but rather than it being something that encourages people to play more, I think it might act as potentially a deterrent for some people who will look at it, work out exactly how many they can get on the days that they are able to play the game and go, well, I'm never going to reach the 100. I can't keep that currency past this point. I'm not going to play the content, particularly because it's not new content. It's rerunning old content. So maybe their intent is to try and force people to play the content or indeed try to force people to put money into the game so that they can receive the stat points. But I think that for some people, this will deter them from the gameplay rather than encourage them to do it. Even for them, find as many of our allies as you can. They're probably already trapped inside conversion crystals. Be careful, though. We have no clue what state they'll be in when released. So it's really, if that's the case, that's making it very hard for people who can only play like once or twice a week. They can't put in enough effort in the game to be able to get what they need in order to receive the full cash. Which is kind of sad. Are people getting the crystals? Did we miss some? We must have. Guys, we must have missed one. It's because we ran in real quick and far. I think people already... Yeah, here. Yeah. There you go. Be afraid. You be afraid. I love how they go in, you know. At least they didn't activate the boss, we hope. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Catwoman, impassioned Catwoman, I apologize. Is she saying something? I didn't hear a word. I thought she spoke then. Maybe she doesn't speak, I don't know. Protect me. Down I go. 
I tried to drink a soda cola, but apparently no. No, no, not having that. Thank you. It's because I'm chatting away while I'm playing. I do that all the time though. <laughs> Catwoman? Impassioned Catwoman. <laughs> I think I took the sh sound from ca Impassioned and kind of applied it to Catwoman for some reason. And now she is Catwoman. That doesn't sound fun, but I mean, she was a thief, right? She was all about the dollars. <laughs> Plans, thank you. Don't miss the crystals this time, guys. Let's get those. There you go. What? The impassioned lanterns are very yellow at the moment. That hardly hurts. Yeah, we're through. Okay. Nice! Anyone know which one it's in? I can't remember. We'll just go for a lucky and hope. There we go. Oh, maybe I was right. Or maybe someone else broke open one at the same time and it happened to be Harley, I don't know. No, it was me! Woo! Go me! <laughs> Take her down! I do realize that it might be difficult for you, but maybe if you could attempt taking her down without singing about it in a high-pitched, shrill voice. That would be nice. So now I'm like, I wouldn't be surprised, you know, get trick the, oh, this is not going well. I wouldn't be surprised every time I start talking. Am I tanking? No, I've got a tank. It's not, not because I'm tanking. I'm so confused. But now I'm just a little concerned that because they've taken this step, are they going to do what I was thinking and end up... Wow, I'm really getting hit hard, aren't I? This is like an early... Why am I getting hit so hard? Nobody knows. Am I doing something weird? Does that question ever really need to be asked? I don't... I just don't know. Anyway. These guys are in a massive rush. Um, now I'm thinking, are they going to end up leading to what I was thinking anyway? but it looks like it's on me. Yep, totally on you, okay. I'm called fatality. Are you ready to face me? I mean, we're already doing it, so it's a bit of a weird question. Is that all that you've got? Yes. All of my other things are locked out at the moment, so yes, that's all I've got. What a real fight. Ugh, so much love, love. Can not compare to fear? There's a feat for these, right? Get them all out? Can't remember. He's doing it. Too late. Did we get it? We'll get the rest of the folks out there. You can head back to Earth for now. My resolve protecting your death. Coercion. So I believe you will find these items to be of great interest. Yeah, see how it says 2024 on these? I feel like they're putting restrictions on everything for each year. So the Batman currency 2024, I don't think you're going to be able to spend that next Batman day. Same for the Wonder Woman uh, currency and now also the Outsider currency. I feel like they're putting the year on it very intentionally to let us know you need to spend that before the end of the year because after that it's going to be gone. And um, if I am right about that, which I may not be, they have not explicitly said that anywhere that I know of, but if that is the case, then anyone who plays through this content and then something happens and they can't get through their last couple of days or whatever to be able to get themselves up to 100 won't be able to get this cash because it's going to disappear at the end of the event. I assume they will keep Katana here just like Catwoman is kept in the House of Legends as well. With this available, like we should be able to get the source marks and everything like that, tokens, whatever. Um, I assume that will stay available um, until at least the end of the year, but this is me guessing. I am guessing. I don't know. I 
I have no idea. So um, I will have a look at some other people's videos after this, see if they maybe are aware, like Obsidian Chill and Multiverse, probably have more information on this than I do. But um, yeah, I like to go into these things without knowing, you know, a little fresh. So um, all the information I have is only the stuff that came up on my screen that first time. And I think I had a Twitter X, whatever it's called, um, thing come up as well to let, let us know about this too and Discord, but I think Discord was exactly the same thing on my uh, Twitter, so... Ah! X! <laughs> X seems like a weird thing to call it for me, because I've always associated that letter X with things like triple X or explicit content, so I find it odd that uh, Twitter or X is called X, because I don't really associate that with explicit content, it's just people with their opinions having a chat. So... I don't know. <laughs> so it seems odd for me to call it X, but I'm trying to get in the hang of it. You know, it's just not very easy. And also people say X for like their X. So when I say X, I don't want it to get mixed up with other things. Twitter didn't get mixed up. X is a word that could get mixed up with things quite easily. So <laughs> yeah, I'm getting used to it though. I don't want this to be a pay to win game. I really don't. And I know that a lot of things in here we can pay for, but stat points have always not been something we could put money in and receive. But we can put money in and receive that. In fact, let's do it. This raid could take who knows how long because I'm on Xbox. We don't know. I'm not in a particularly big league or anything on here. So let's go to the marketplace. I already put funds in so that we could do this. So obviously you can see it here. We can also go across to currency in this tab and see it here. We can get... 50, 20, 100, or 5. So obviously we want 100 of these so that we can open that cash. So let's do that. Thank you. So now we should have that currency in our inventory. We'll just look and make sure. There we go. So now we're on 113. So we're going to speak to Katana. To serving as a vendor, and then we are going we to are. grab this. Then we're going to open it. Let's see how this works. Open. Open the Outsiders Ops 2024 skill cache. It gives us, oh sorry, cash. I'm trying to get in the swing of saying cash for it. A hundred points on multiple. Okay, obviously, because 100 um, points is what gives us one skill point. So we have to get a thousand. So there will be 10 of these 100, which means there should be feats listed somewhere, right? So let's go to the feats list. It's an event. After Halloween? No. Oh, there it is. Outsider Ops. Okay. So we have just completed all of these feats. Does this mean we can unlock this on another character? I mean, if we can unlock it on another character, that's not bad. Let's go swap characters for a second. Oh, wait. Let's go over here and look at the stat points. So we've just received 10 stat points, right? And obviously I had one already. So... That's not bad. Cool. Very nice. Let's let's swap to another character. We'll come back for the raid. If we can get into it. I mean, I did pick Xbox to do this on because of other content that I need to record. So right following this, I'm going to go on with base two as another things that I'm recording. So I probably would have had much more luck getting in if I was on PSUS. Even just PS. PSEU is better than Xbox as well. It goes incrementally. You know, Switch is kind of dead. Then Xbox isn't so dead. EU is doing pretty good. And then US is doing amazing. So let's jump onto my fire villain. Okay, so let's go into the feats. And event, and then scroll down to that ops thing here, outside of ops. <gasps> we can unlock them! Oh, we have to, wait. They cost seven each. We're paying seven each for what, 100? Ah! That's fantastic! So it cost you 70 replay badges. I mean, I'm okay with that. So then let's go and see how many stat points that gives us 10, right? It gave us 10! Oh my goodness! You only have to do this on one character. You purchase on one character and you can unlock with all your other characters. That's, that's not bad. I mean, if you play multiple characters, if you're someone whose main focus is on one character, it's not that amazing, but that's pretty amazing for me. I have too many characters, and that means I can unlock it everywhere. Oh, I love that. Ah! 
You only have to, I mean, if you don't want to pay, fair enough, but if you do pay, it's gonna cost you 3,600 or I'm guessing 4,000 in um, marketplace cash for um, someone who's not with a membership. Yeah, see, look, no, this is a limited time currency and must be spent before the event ends. I, if that's the case, fair enough, you need to spend it before the event ends, but that means that it doesn't carry over to next year. I think I'm right about this. I dislike that about it. I don't mind it so much with the Batman and Wonder Woman content because those rewards um, had quite a lot of cheaper ones that were relevant to the event. This one doesn't. It's simply that 100 and then a bunch of currency. And then if you manage to get up to a second set of 100, you can get yourself quarks, which I think is pretty cool because they are quite sought after, valuable, give you access to a bunch of really cool items that you may not have had access to previously because whether you haven't been playing as long or can't get the capsules, whatever. I like that. I think that's kind of cool. But I dislike the limit of it being just for the year because for for me it's not a problem for a lot of people it's not a problem but for some people it is some people can't play this every day and try to get all the content completed it may not take long to try to run through the content but some people don't have that time and now they can't accumulate it and wait and then eventually get these things they are just stuck without it if they don't get enough of the content played which is I don't know I, I don't personally like that I can see why they have done it though but I personally no not a big fan of that choice. But I will say I'm not a huge fan of making stat points something you can purchase either. I'm glad it's not what I thought. I'm glad this isn't a, hey, here's a bundle of all this content other people have played that you can pay for and get your stat points. Because I won't lie, if that came out, depending on the price, I would likely buy it. Because I can't... Uh, Maybe not on the US server, but here on Xbox, there's not a lot of us playing through older content, you know? It's hard, especially because half of the people on the Xbox server are not even in the same place as me, which means that they are asleep at the times that I play, which means I'm not on and able to get a large group going for a lot of content. And then also get them to coordinate to complete the feats that I want to complete. Doesn't always happen, you know? And I've reserved myself to that fact. That's fine. I just play for fun anyway. I'm not looking to build my character up to the max. I already did that kind of on the Switch for a while, but no, no. <laughs> it's kind of not the easiest thing to do, go back and get those things completed on this particular server on the Xbox, and I will say probably for EU as well. I'll say on US, there is enough people there, especially there's enough people who are trying to do the same thing, which is run through older content and get feats for stuff that they haven't been able to play before. So that is a little bit safer to try and complete older feats, but not on here. It's, it's uh, particularly for me, I will say, if there's... If the majority of the people on the Xbox are in the US, for example, and are awake playing at the same time, maybe you guys have better luck on here getting through that sort of thing. But because I am usually on here when people are sleeping, it's less likely for me to be able to get that content completed. So if they did bring out a bundle that gave me the opportunity to purchase the stat points from a bunch of content that I don't get to play at the moment, or that I can play but can't get the feats completed for, it would have to be for a bunch of raids, honestly, because I can usually get all solo feats I can do just fine, duo feats I can do just fine, alerts you usually can, just got to pick your timing and find the right people, raids are hard, trying to find eight people who are willing to get through some of the feats is just not going to happen for some of it, some people refuse to listen to if you just say hey guys I'm aiming for this feat can you just please make sure you do blah 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 and you get a bunch of yeah no problems and then this one rogue player who runs out and does something else and you're like ah, all right well I was playing this content specifically for that thank you <laughs> so that's a little sad if they brought out I, I'm going off on a massive tangent here but if they brought out a bundle that gave me the ability to unlock the feats of some particular raids or something like that I'd buy it. I'd buy it because I can't get that content completed. And then that kind of is a little bit of a, you know, slap in the face to all the people who grinded their butts off to get that content completed, to get those feats. And I'm just like, throw money at it. Done. <laughs> you know, it's unfair. If they gave me that, I would buy it. So they may well do it because I don't think I'm the only one. I would do it here on Xbox. Let me clarify, I don't know that I would do it on the US server because I feel like if I wanted to try to run some content to get feats completed, I can find a group of people. There's enough people there that that's probably likely to occur. 
but here there it's not it's not gonna happen i would have to be raids if they gave a bundle that was for like alerts and solos and duos i'd be like no but if it was like you can um if it was a choice if they gave us a bundle that gave us here are some free feet unlocks and you could go through and pick a particular amount of feats to unlock based on however many points it would cost you to do it or whether it's a raid or an alert whatever i would i would buy that and i would unlock feats on raids that i cannot get people to coordinate on and, and then, you know, I'd never ever have to actually do that feat on this console and I would get the stat points for it. So, I mean, I don't know where they're going. I did think that they were going to make stat points monetized somehow and they have. So I don't know if this is good or bad. I mean, it's good today while I'm playing through the content and able to get uh, well, I'm playing through the content and paying for it because I was showing you guys. But yeah, <laughs> um, it's good right now but I don't know where this is leading, you know? And I do very much dislike this restriction on the currency. I don't, I don't think that's fair. Uh, and the funny thing is, it doesn't actually affect me. I have no problem playing through the content. I'm able to get on here every day or almost every day. Like this weekend, I have a party to go to. That day, most likely I won't play at all. But, um, you know, for the majority of the time, I get to log in at least, or I get to play through whatever event is happening um, enough that that's not a problem for me. I could play through it till the end and be able to get whatever I need to and that's fine. But I am rare. It's rare that I'm able to do that. I can do that because I work from home. I don't have any travel time for my job. So I'm here. So this is pretty easy for me to be able to get on and get what I need done. This is the Quarks vendor. Booster so this is Mr. Gold. Gold. Approved and endorsed. If you're able to get both the stats cash and then the Quarks cash, this is where you're able to spend that currency for anyone who doesn't know. So quarks is something you can normally only get through a capsule opening. And the reason it gives you those quarks is so that you can go and purchase items that have previously been available in other capsules that you may no longer have access to or where there's an item that you may have missed and you just want to be able to find it nice and quick um, and you can't find it at the broker that someone else is selling. So if you go along here and you press um, RT, you can just scroll to the side and it'll tell you which capsule it's referencing at the top there. You can scroll down, find the item that you're after and purchase it with the quarks. So um, quarks is something I really enjoy accumulating, but I do so because every time I do a capsule video for you guys and show you what you can receive from it, I try to come across to this vendor and purchase the items of armor that have been missed from my opening of that capsule so that we can see the full armor style together and you'll know whether you want to get it or not for other people it's handy to grab because you can get like so many cool bits and pieces not necessarily in armor completion so there's like auras and chromas and materials and i mean the armor completion is also good but if i was coming here just for things i like there would be lots of chroma purchasing particularly was there void i would get the void oh i would also get this bubble bubble movement on every character there's water and quantum because most of my water and quantum characters look like they should be in a pool so <laughs> that that movement is awesome but it's also expensive you know so I'm not gonna spend that much on it <laughs> but there's a lot of cool stuff in here all right so it looks like I'm not going to be able to get into the raid on here I can see in the chat that a lot of people are queuing up for particular other things which is fine so I am going to log off of my Xbox and I will jump across to my PlayStation now because I have played through my PlayStation content through a separate means of recording in order to be able to capture Outlander's voice in my videos um, I actually can record the content without using my current setup to be able to capture that raid. So let's give it a try. There we go, getting into the raid. Of course we're getting into the raid. Now that we're on the PlayStation on the US server, raid happens like this. Not this many times, just once. <laughs> Yay! Love and war. Love and war, love versus war. Love and war, it's love and war. The Star Sapphire's interstellar teleport can send us to Zamoron and Carol Ferris, but you'll need to help me acquire the rings of several star sapphires. Okie dokie. You'll also need an understanding of how their technology works. Lure out their elite by destroying the crystal formations in the area. Okay. They hate that. Oh, yes, and we love doing things that they hate. Man, I haven't played this in so long. Oh, so long. It's a little 
nostalgic. It's been ages since I've played this content. I will say, if nothing else, this event has caused me to play content that I haven't played in a long time and do quite enjoy. I mean, the duo and the alert are both so beautiful to look at because of all that purple crystal. It's just gorgeous and I love it. So I have kind of missed playing those. And this I have missed as well. It's just a good, fun, open gameplay. Uh, they don't make raids like this anymore. <laughs> Take them down. Do you remember what I said earlier about the high-pitched singing? I'm wondering if maybe we can make the same concession for the high-pitched whatever that was. Oh, I kind of missed those. <laughs> I think the last time I played this was back when I was playing on the Switch, like quite often. I'm not playing on the Switch often anymore, let me tell you. Any love in your heart, John, take my ring. Yay! Interrogate Star Sapphire Sentinel about interstellar teleporter. Do we not have an arrow? I honestly don't remember if there's a trick to that or anything. That's how long it's been. That's how long it's been. <laughs> Definitely time to pick up the pace. It, he wasn't healing. Yeah, true. Yeah, unfortunately, we've lost our healer. And, um, yeah, we weren't getting a lot of heals from that person, that player, so that's a little sad. I think some people play a battle healer and um, don't notify the group that they are actually a battle healer instead of just a straight up healer. And then we assume that they're gonna do the healing because they don't let us know that they're actually battle healer. So um, that's a little sad when that happens because it makes it a lot harder for the rest of us to play because we're depending on them for something that they're not going to do. Yeah, so just a note, if you are playing a character who is battle healer, please let your group know when you load in so they don't think that they're depending on you for the heals as much. Because, um, yeah, that was a little issue here for us. <laughs> yeah, we've got, we're trying to stay together, but some people seem to be running off. Which way are we going, guys? Okay. Tank. We have a tank. We have everything. We have a tank. We have healer. We have controller. Nice. A star sapphire believer. I think. I know it doesn't say believer, but that's the first thing I thought. <laughs> nice to know they enjoy music. <laughs> Let's take them down. Do, 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 do. It doesn't seem to be helping them out very much, though, I will say. <laughs> I wasn't coughing off camera. I don't know why you would think that. Love is the key to the Fortunately, I have a plan. Oh. That should be enough rings. We know how to operate the teleporter, and I have the rings we need. Your voice is so quiet. Part of the music voice. I don't know. I don't know what that particular voice is actually considered to be so i'm i'm i often have the issue of not knowing which volume to adjust when they do like a cut in of their voice while we're playing because it doesn't seem to be the one that says voice it's something else so music it's clearly not the background sound so i'm guessing it's the music one i don't know but i turned them all up so hopefully that helps Try to take it easy on the star sapphires. More than a few are XGLs and friends of mine. Try to take it easy on them. That seems like an unwise decision. Look how many there are! I mean, we are pretty awesome, so maybe not. <laughs> maybe it doesn't matter, we're fine. This guy keeps saying to stay together and this one guy keeps floating around down the back. I don't know what's going on. Maybe he's busy at the same time. coming. There he is. You're back, dude! 
why my character is aiming the way that she's aiming. There's like an enemy directly in front of her and she goes, you know what? You see that enemy over there on the balcony that my um, attacks cannot reach? Let's aim for them. Hi Zatanna, you're not looking so good. Pink is not your color. It's nobody's color. We should ban the pink. <laughs> Actually, I, have, I don't really have anything against pink. I don't wear pink very much because it tends to make my face look even more red than it already is. And we don't need me to look like a tomato wearing a beanie, okay? So I don't tend to wear pink very much. I do sometimes wear red, which tends to do a similar thing, but I break it up with another color and then I look less tomato-y, okay? There are reasons for things. They don't make a lot of sense, never mind. <laughs> Take down the champion over here so that they can focus on Satana. Some champion you are. <laughs> Sorry guys. It's going quite well, quite fast. I mean, that was to be expected. It is an older raid, but it's good fun. <sighs> Send down the champion again, who is not going to be much of a champion when I am finished with her. <laughs> Keep getting stuck on that. Up, up and over. No, I'm picking up the person. The middle. Okay. I got you. I've got you under my skin. Actually, that sounds disgusting. Every time I sing that song, I kind of regret it. Don't get under my skin, that would be weird, guys. Sometimes I think you really just should not have permission to speak. Yeah, 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 you, ha you have a point. I, I should not be allowed to speak, I, yeah. Fair, fair enough. Wait for Hell and Sinestro. There's Hell with Sinestro. Did he go off on some kind of a holiday? Here he comes. Took you long enough, sir. What were you doing? Sinestro, are those star <coughs> sapphire rings? I told you not to kill anyone. Do not fear. They're still alive. For now. That, that sounds bad. The rings will engage the teleporter. But I'm told true love is required to direct it at Xamaron. Your childish feelings for Carol Ferris should suffice. Ha ha. Just make sure that when we get there, everyone gives me time to reason with Carol. No! Alright, alright. Ooh, someone's having a fun. Let's go. It's time to go. Yay! Purple crystals! It's so pretty in here. Okay, people, let's hit the afterburners. Alright. We certainly don't want to hit the before furnace because it's no longer before and it is now after, so, you know. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about, so just ignore me. Or maybe you should adhere to that whole not having permission to speak thing. I love that, um, what is that? The net that catches people in place. I can't remember what ability that's from. Darn it! The one that's basically like weapons. Machinist, no. Ah! The one that has everything called watchful. Munitions, I remembered. Munitions ability where they can like, throw that net that drops down the characters, the NPCs on the floor. Very nice, big fan. See, there you are, trapped. <laughs> they always are asking for 
things to protect them and guess what? They never come through. The protection does not occur. Instead the burning and the getting trapped in the net thing. <laughs> see any amethyst mist time to phone home Indeed. what a shame amethyst mist is so pretty hands. even if we don't want it i would just like to see it anyway okay mogo put Rain it behind the jacket. shield stand back Check we're already back. standing back that's like when everyone is silently listening and they go be quiet <laughs> Whirling Dervish is absolutely without a doubt my favorite AoE in this game. No matter what superpower I have, Whirling Dervish is still the best AoE. <laughs> or at least my favorite. I don't know if it's the best. In fact, I'm, I'm quite sure there are circumstances where it's technically not, but still my favorite. <laughs> was that someone attacked Wonder Woman just before the film clip started so it probably shut off this section during that cutscene and so Carol people couldn't get in and I didn't realize till I turned around and saw that there were so few of us that's shockingly bad only three of us were inside oh god this guy is very very insistent upon starting ASAP Jeez. Do you remember earlier what I said about how sometimes you've got people who are just not really going with what the group is trying to do? This would be one such occasion where we've got one person who is intent upon running everything as quick as possible and the rest of the group all trying to get this feat completed for another player where Carol spawns and now apparently that's not going to happen. So. Yeah, it's tough when you've got someone like that in your group. And I'm down. <laughs> what hit me? That one was weird, right? A little weird. I don't know what that was. Oh, someone's got her. <laughs> I'm trying to pick up someone who's already getting picked up. That's a little pointless. I'm curious what exactly is making us get knocked down because I don't actually see anything 
go towards us. See, it just kind of happens. Am I missing something? Maybe it's happening so quickly that I don't see it. I don't know. None. Style, thank you. But, uh, never mind. You wouldn't <laughs> understand it, I. Hal, how dare you betray me by bringing him here? Yeah! No, no. Carol, we've come to help you. Help me? With Sinestro, you I mean, how would you react? Here. We're wasting time. Restrain her. I mean, I don't know that I disagree with her, really, because... He did bring Sinestro. It's not the smartest move. I'd be pretty annoyed too. He's not the most trustworthy people. Person. You know what I mean. <laughs> the really fun thing about this is I can't swap over to my boss battle build because look at this. All of my builds are currently locked because I got 10 free stat points. And now <laughs> all of my builds are inaccessible well done me so i probably should have gone to my armories and sorted that situation out before loading into here because that was a silly silly move oh how unlike you need to block that okay keep that in mind i don't know what we're blocking though i think maybe i'm not seeing whatever is coming for some reason i'll pull back and, and watch for it I was in the air, I couldn't block even if I wanted to. Whoops! Ah! <laughs> Are you trying to pick me up? Oh, okay, okay, I'm up again. Cool, 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 cool. Let's get everybody back up. Oh, geez. This is not going as well as I would like. <laughs> I wish I could just, oh wait, while I'm in this screen, I can swap out my loadouts, right? Let's at least check on this. Do I want to swap? There's nothing else I can swap fast enough that's going to be helpful. That will at least help me a little. Okay, or not. It may help me nothing at all. Never mind. <sighs> Pop, shield. Let's take them down, downtown. Let's not take them downtown. That seems like a terrible idea. By the light of love. By the light of love. <laughs> take down some of these freaking ads that just refuse to go away. No, ads first, ads first. No, not ads first, me first. <laughs> They just refuse to go down. Okay, they just keep spawning. Maybe I should be focusing on Carol first. How crazy does that music sound when it's put at triple speed? Also, this tank is doing a good job. <laughs> I say standing way over here, not doing much. <laughs> My character has the most bizarre aim sometimes. Take her down to do 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 Just moving into the crowd now makes that more fun to try to aim for up.
Yeah, nice try, pal. <laughs> Yay! Finally. Karen, oh. is it you? I mean, just you? The predator is out of my mind. Ah, oh, I mean, good. Good. We don't want that. That's bad. To the battery. I'll get the word out to the star satellite. I mean, <laughs> that's lovely. <laughs> I'm sorry, but there's more than that. Enough pillow talk. Carol Ferris, the but this was pillow talk? We was just standing around for pillow talk? Must join our alliance or everyone Her character looks cool. Will pay a heavy price. Why should I believe you? Yeah. Believe me. Okay. okay. <laughs> oh, I was right! Let's okay! Talk. Let's go to bed, have some pillow talk. You know, if we're going to be accused of it, might as well go ahead and have some. <laughs> Alright, what did I get for my loot? Any, any cool furniture? No. Well, let's go with this one. That would be what my brother says. We got ten of the coins for that. Lovely. Thank you. Bye, guys. Um, I'm going to. I'm pretty sure. Currently, I'm on the PlayStation, so I'm pretty sure I have not actually played through this content on here before. So I'm gonna run back through, have a quick look, see if there were any briefings in here that I need to grab because I don't think I've grabbed anything in here on PlayStation before. So I will just do that. I don't remember where they are either, or even if there are any, because it's been so long. So let's just investigate. And wouldn't this make such a pretty base? It'd be such a pretty base. I want this. Look at that for a, the walls. Oh, I just love it. I just love it. It's gorgeous. And then I'd have to make a star, star Sapphire character who is only a Star Sapphire character. I have Star Sapphire character, but she is also Starfire and Blackfire and Donna Troy. Like, she's got a range of characters that she just becomes. But if I had a base like this, I would obviously have to create an actual star sapphire. Am I going backwards the way I came? No, I'm not. That's good, because I've done that before, you know? Let's keep looking. I don't hear any um, sparkly type sounds. It's funny that there's a sound that I can say and everyone will know what I mean by sparkly sound, even though technically sparkly is a visual concept, not a, an audio concept, I, I think. So, yay, we're done, let's get out of here. And then we definitely need to go and fix up the armories because now I can't access any of them. I went into a raid without them. Oh yeah, that was a bad idea. I should have gone gone back where I was. Look at that! Very nice. Well, I say very nice, but look at the amount of times I got knocked out there, guys. It's not, not so pleasant. <laughs> but we did all right. Let's leave the group mission. And let's head to the House of Legends. <sighs> it's now peaceful. <laughs> and as far as I could tell, there were no briefings or investigations inside of that particular section of the raid. So, good, good to know, I guess. Hello, Katana. Well done. Thank you. I encourage you to continue your participation in this program. As an incentive, I will reward you with helpful items as you prove yourself. Thank you. I love helpful items. Is that really true? Or is that she just saying that because we already get like helpful items as we complete tasks, like armor pieces that I've got here. I, mm. And then we can buy currency with our currency. <laughs> I mean, the only really, really good item that's in there, actually there's two. I am not accustomed but this is the really, really good item and this is not here bad. We are. You know? Okay, anyway, bye Katana. I need to go home and sort out my wardrobe because um, we have a massive wardrobe mishap by which I can't wear any of my clothes except what I'm currently wearing. That sounded like I'm sitting here naked. You know what I mean. Never mind. Hello, Isis. Pretty kitty. Hello, super cat. Hello, Teagle. Actually, I don't, is it, I don't know what to call you. I have three cats. I didn't even know that I had three cats. All right, that's fine. <laughs> okay, let's sort this out. So currently my main is this one here, so let's activate. And then let's spend our stat points. 
Um, I'm going to put some in here now because I feel like I should. So we'll go with that and we'll save. That's the first one done. Then we have to go over here to me. This is myself. <laughs> Beautiful. Actually, I should check armor as, as well. I don't think I had any damage armor that was helpful. No, 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 no. But um, it looks like I have a tank one, so good to know. Let's do stat points. See, look, this is what I should have been using while we were in the raid. I couldn't, so <laughs> I brought this on myself. Let's spend our stat points here too. Uh, we'll put another 10 in here because I can't help myself. There we go. Save. Ah, it looks like me. She's so cool. I actually have a top that has this crisscross thing and I have a jacket like this too. So this is pretty darn accurate. I mean, I'm not wearing it right now. It doesn't have a flashy skull on the back, but I took a little bit of creative liberty. You know, I mean, my headset doesn't have ears either, but I don't care. It's super cool. Okay, so next one I have to save is Batgirl. Batgirl was over here. She is my first tank build. Activate all and probably I think I have a armor piece. Yeah, neck piece that we can trade in and those two are useless. And then we have stat points to put where we need. So where do we want? I think I'll put my 10 into here now. Now that we've got enough and chuck the rest there. Save. Yay, and then my last one is Starfire. Hello, Starfire. Okay, and she is my battle tank, which means she will also need this. And then we need to put stat points in place. That's not stat points, that's that's feats. I, I, never mind. I want to put three in here. I want seven in there. Okay, then we've got a two floater. Where are we going to aim next? I don't really need... See, the thing is with the healing stuff, my character is quite capable of healing herself without this being that high. I really don't need that, it to be full necessarily, but I like it to be full. I like it to be that bit quicker when I'm getting healed, so I don't know if that's... I, I don't know. We, we might leave it, and since this is my battle tank and I'm on 70 here, 50 here, we'll I aim for here for the moment, um, because I want her damage output to at least rival her health level there, so... That will be it. And that is her done. Oh, it's just so pretty. And oh, she's surrounded by butterflies. You know? Okay, I'll, I'm, I'm fine. <clears throat> and we're fine. <laughs> Normally I would break those down at the salvage station, but um, I have a really good reason for not doing that. And it's because I can't. This is meant to be a secret bedroom. There we go. Now it's a secret. Okay, good. We're going in here. Why I have a branch above my bed, I don't know. It looks pretty. Okay, it's it's just pretty up there with the leaves. Oh, that's so it stays. I have a king bed in this one. Sweet! All right, let's go to sleep. I mean, she's going to sleep in a lot of layers of clothing. Hopefully, this was helpful and lets you know what content we are currently running and at least entertaining if, you know, I, I was a little bit rambly, I know. But hopefully it was entertaining if it wasn't uh, informative, if you already know what's going on. So, you have a good one, guys. <laughs>